Hey guys, it is the night before my morning routine and every good morning routine starts with going to bed early. So I am going to do that right now and tomorrow I'm gonna wake up, I'm gonna show you the craziness, the fun, the, I don't even know what to call it, that we have to do every morning as we get the kids ready for school. 10 of them, by the way. All right, let's get going. Actually, let's go to bed. Hey guys, whoa, got some cockadoodle doo hair going on. It's 5.30 in the morning and I am so excited because I am filming a morning routine this morning and it is all new and completely different. Like I shifted everything of what I normally do and I have made it so much better. I've been doing it now for three weeks and it has made my life, I don't know. Benji, do you agree? Definitely has helped. It should make us do things on time. Like yes. <laughs> First thing I've changed up is I wake up a little bit earlier than I used to. That is hard because your body just gets used to certain things. So my ultimate goal is that I will wake up at five because I need my me time, people. I don't care how old you are. I don't care how many kids you have or if you don't have kids yet. We need our me time because it just completely changes everything. I've done this for probably, I don't even know, probably like 25 years. And whenever I wake up at five, it's like the best because I have a full hour of me time. That's my goal. It's been a little slow coming. I mean, you can tell, look at this. I've had this wall for how long? Can you see that right there? People, you see that right there? The hour when legends are either waking up or going to sleep. I want to be a legend. 5.30 for a while, for another couple weeks, then it will be like a little bit easier for my brain and body <laughs> to wake up. But that's my ultimate goal. So what I do in the morning is I um, have my morning prayer and I read my scriptures. Um, I write in my journal. I just kind of set up my day, think about things in peace without little kids going, mommy, 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 you know, cause that can be very distracting. So I just try to get that all set up for the day and then I can wake up the kids. And it's so much more pleasant when I'm able to wake up the kids than, you know, some of the days if I miss my morning routine and they're waking me up, it really throws off your day. So if you are a mom, I would highly encourage waking up before your kids, even if it's only 15 minutes so that you can just kind of do your thing and wake them up and feel a little bit more in control of your day. I'm gonna get busy reading my scriptures and doing my thing before they start mommy miming or waking up on their own. I will see you in a minute. I love to decorate my scriptures. Helps me to remember what I'm studying. Okay, now that my morning time is complete, I'm gonna show you guys my schedule. So this is my planner and I know a lot of stuff I do plan on my phone like most of you, but there's something very like uplifting and fulfilling for me to like write it down with my own handwriting. So I rewrote my schedule out and this is kind of the new an improved version, but I just follow it all day long. I make little tweaks and changes if I need to. Also, I set alarms on my phone, which is huge because it keeps me on task. Like if I'm in the middle of something, my alarm goes off, I know, oh, by now I'm supposed to be getting dressed or by now I'm supposed to be getting ledger out the door. Alarms, alarms, alarms. And I set fun music to the alarms. And so it's not just an annoying alarm. It's like some music that really makes me, I don't know, like, maybe reminds me of that child and how much I love them or reminds me of getting motivated to go work out or whatever song like just is good for that moment, for that alarm and encourage you to also add that. It takes a little bit longer, but it is worth the extra effort. You ask what this is behind me. Heard of like a vision board before? Well, this is like my vision wall. And so I did this years ago, but I move things as I, I don't know, just as I get the thought or as something else jumps into my mind, like I hear a saying during the day, I'll be like, oh, I need to add that to my wallet. It's super like motivating or it reminds me of really important things. Anyway, so it's like my vision board, my vision wall. All right, six o'clock, time to go wake up kids. And you guys, my alarm is going off. You can't hear it, but I hear it. One thing that is new is normally I used to wake up all of the kids and we would have it at seven o'clock, but I've completely shifted when I do my morning devotional, which has helped me a ton because I used to have the little boys in there during the devotional, which is also for the teenagers and so forth. Um, but it just was like, they weren't getting a lot out of it. And it kind of made it, to be honest, hard for the older kids to get something out of it. And so I was like, 
why am I doing this? I have plenty of time in the morning for them to have their own little kind of more kid-friendly, really young kid-friendly devotional and um, inspiration for the day. And it looks a lot different, right, than um, inspiring a 16-year-old. So I'm like, duh, why have I done this now? I've done this like with them all together at 7 a.m. for probably at least six years. Now I have switched up and I'm like, dude, what was I thinking? Paisley, Delaney June. Are you waking up? You must not turn off the light when it's time to wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up. So enjoyable waking up children in the morning. It actually is, it's one of my favorite things to do. Good morning, good morning. I know it's rough. The bright sun is shining. Hi, Cozy Morning. I know Cozy's excited too. Time to head down to devotional. Cozy's gonna wake you up now too. <laughs> Cozy. She's gonna be the Oh gosh. All right, wakey wakey. Miss Elsie Fades, where are you? Are you awake? Elsie? Is she up there? Elsie! Elsie? Oh, there she is. There you are! I was thinking maybe you had like, you know, I don't know. I woke up at One six. of your sister's room. It is six. I you know. <laughs> I want to still sleep. It's time for morning devotional. Luke! Coming! All right, Luke is coming. Teenagers in the morning. Not their best moment. I don't know if I can blame them. But you know what? It's so much better because before when I woke them up at seven, some of them were already ready to go to school. Hello. Good morning. And they'd be a little bit antsy like while we were having devotional, so they really couldn't listen because they were like, okay, well, we gotta go, we gotta go. So this way, I just want to listen so well. Okay, you guys have to see this. Yeah, construction happening in here. So if you jump on to Nentum, we keep doing secret rooms and yeah, just wait and see. All right, Miss Sadie, maybe. Oh, she's already gone. I think they're already heading down. I've taken too long because I'm talking to you guys to wake up the kids. I've got all the older kids awake. So like the oldest eight we have in the morning devotional at 6 a.m. Ten. And you'll see this a little bit later in the day. The boys came down later and they have a separate devotional with them. So a lot of people ask like, what do I talk about for morning devotional? It's different every time, but for the most part, I talk on the scriptures or something else that was really motivating to me. Um, my alarm says teach of Christ. And so it inspires me and it has a beautiful song on it. So it just inspires me to have a really touching devotional um, teaching about Christ. Ready for the day. Hey guys, so I'm gonna hurry and start doing my morning routine. But my morning routine isn't as complicated as them. What I do is I get ready in my workout clothes and there's a very good reason for that. If you watch my other morning routines. I'm more energetic now that I kind of just walk up the stairs, I don't really know. But first actually I'm gonna go brush my teeth and then we're gonna go wash my face. And everyone's kind of in here. Delaney and Elsie are both in here. Oh. That was scary. Also don't mind this. These are like my room mills, but I kind of got bugged with these ones so I clipped them and I really regret it now. But I have an idea you guys. Since Presley has such an exquisite um, morning and nighttime and day routine, I think I'm gonna do a Presley routine. They're not. You're yeah. not using myself. They're fighting in the background about cleanser makeup, which I don't really use because I got perfect skin. My skin has been so dry lately. Wash my face. We're gonna wash my face away. 
<laughs> so don't mind how I look. I'm super pale in the winter. But I plugged in the curl and now I'm gonna curl my hair. But I'm just gonna show the last few pieces cause no, I look a little this. weird when I curl my hair. See, this sink is weird. Ooh. What's happening? Watch me dance. That's a night away. So here's me in my PJs. Ha! Ah! All right, another fun idea. If you are like struggling to lose weight or need some motivation to work out, one thing I've done in the past is get like something, you don't have to get stuff from Lululemon, like and get stuff from Walmart or like a less expensive place, but something that's dedicated for you to wear when you work out. I know that sounds silly, but I used to like just work out in like shorts or like, uh, I don't know, but it just helped me to have like an actual workout outfit that I know and my brain knows when I put this on, I'm ready to work out people, I'm ready to sweat. And I don't know, just a good motivator. And then like, as you lose weight, um, it's super fun to like have to size down a little bit. Anyway, it's another fun thing. Another thing is in the morning when I get ready, I actually do get a little bit ready. So I brush my teeth, I zhuzh the face a tiny bit. I just make it so that if after the workout, I have to like run a quick errand or I don't feel completely like unraveled, I feel like I still, and put together and life's okay even if I have to run a few errands in my workout outfit. When I say I zhuzh my face, I definitely don't apply like a full face of makeup. I maybe use cover up on anything like really exciting that's happening on my face that I really don't want others to see like the occasional breakout and so forth. Just put a little lip gloss on, just kind of make sure that I don't have any gook anywhere and just kind of, I don't know, just, you know, make it a little bit present. <laughs> Our life. They're the best things ever. First thing we're gonna start with is this Paula's Choice. And I just take a little bit on my hands and I just go like that. And I kind of just like rub it out everywhere. But we are done coming this side. Now it's time for the other side and then I'll go get dressed. So I know you're supposed to do serum, a full moisturizer, blah, blah, blah. But this is better for my skin. It's helped it more. So guys, this is the biggest part of my routine. Like, this and this help my skin so much. I'm so tired today. I kid you not, I cannot do this. School is schooling me to another level. Today is a B day and it's gonna be a great day, guys. It's gonna be a great day. Now we're gonna go upstairs and go do my makeup. I'm ready, time to go check my list. Time to wake the boys. First I'll wake up Mr. Whoa. What happened in here? Holy cow. It looks like he made a pile. Caution is right though, so I mean, at least he used the appropriate pillow for the topper. What happened? That's <laughs> your. Okay, now we're on the last piece of my hair. Well, on the bottom of my hair. I'll use this blush, because I love this blush. It's like the best blush. Time to do the hair. I don't know what I want to do my hair like. Do I want to put it up? Possibly if I want to look tired and then curled up, I don't want to. So we're going to debate on that and then we will decide. Time to put my refry primer on. So how you say it? Refry? Refy? I think I just said refy. Wait, I think that is right. I don't know what I'm saying. Good morning, good morning. The bright sun is shining. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Oh, so cute. Guys, comment down below. Should I do my hair darker than it is right now? Or should I just keep it this color and do low lights? You guys comment down below. I literally look crazy right now. But we are starting on the first piece of my hair. And I swear I've shown you guys how to curl my hair, but some new viewers we're gonna show you. Okay, so you're gonna grab your curling iron. This one is the Biomic. Um, I love this one. It just is like perfect for my type of hair and how I curl it. But basically you're gonna like roll it in. You wanna curl it away from your face. And then you're just gonna hold it home. And then you bring it down, clamp it, and then roll up and like curl it away from your face. Cause you don't want the curls going towards your face. You want them away. Wait, what? Um. I'm gonna call it good. 
I'ma call good. Now we move on. Move on to makeup. Oh, you're so big. Did you have a good sleep? You did? Good. When did you do your pile? Before bed? Yeah. Will you help me unravel your pile? I wanna keep it like that. You wanna keep it like that? Some people keep it out my window. Okay, so I would use this purple moisturizer from Katcha. I don't like it as much as the green one. I think so. Like I feel like it's more thick and I don't like thicker ones. I just like the other one more. But they feel really good when you put them in your mini fridge and then put them on your face. You don't understand, like, the way they feel is outrageous. I'm sorry, what? Me over here not even know what outrageous means, but still saying it. <laughs> yeah. I can tell. Mommy. Yeah. Wait. It's mommy. I know. We should go get the rest of the duck eggs. I, oh, yeah, we have duck eggs, guys. I mean... It's exciting stuff right yeah, here. Yeah, well, we're gonna get my duck egg and like, mom, we have to like just leave them out there in a good spot. Yeah, the duck eggs are in a good spot and we're just trying to leave them out there so they hatch, huh? All right, I gotta go wake up Mr. B. Mine, that's not even that much. There's only five more. There's only five more than the 40 that, yes, that we have, you're right. Okay, my hair looks good. Now let's go find an outfit. My hair song, my makeup song. Let's go find my outfit. And that's it for my makeup. Now it's time to get dressed for school and we need to hurry and pick up my outfit. All right, slept in Lily's room. Hi, Mr. B. Oh, you did good with your mask. You did so good with your mask. How long did you sleep with your mask? Do you want to see? How long did you get? Push the button. How long? Eight hours and 20, 35 minutes. Holy cow, Mr. B. Woo! Everyone give Mr. B a hip hip hooray. Because he has been using his sleep machine lots better. Do you need a few more Z's? Do you need a couple more Z's? All right, then come down and have some breakfast and devotional, okay? How I work out this time now is the little boys have their morning devotional while they eat breakfast. And I have a new person making breakfast every day. I bet you can't even guess who it is. Maybe you can. Lily! Lily makes amazing breakfast, sometimes mm. in the dark. Sometimes in the dark. She is making blueberry muffins, people. Our favorite kind. Yep. Yes. Now, if you're wondering why Lily is not ready for the day. Well, I don't have to be to school until later. I don't have a first period. Okay, yes. So. Lily is what you call a senior. Yep. And sometimes seniors have worked so hard through the years that their senior year is a little bit easier. So, mm -hmm. yeah, she's got a little bit less classes. So that's why she makes breakfast in the morning. But she's a champion. She makes the breakfast of champions. Breakfast of champions. Because she is a champion. Sun is coming up. Are you ready to go? We can take a ride, we can take it slow Your will is my law, I'ma let you be the boss Cause I'll go where you go I'll take you to a place, we can see it all Step off the edge, I can break your fall your Okay guys, we're in the closet And I kinda wanna wear one of these shirts, but I'm not for sure Nope, don't wanna wear these today This is the outfit we're doing with today so we have these are jeans and then just this striped top. I think that's what we're gonna wear. It actually didn't take me that long to find an outfit. Okay guys, shout out to Alpha Kitty because I freaking love all their stuff so much. Like this hoodie, I wear this hoodie every single day. Like every single day. All right, now we're gonna use. That's the look, you guys. That's the look for the day. Spike up some pieces. All right, you guys, it is now my turn to get ready. I don't have to be to school for a little bit, so I'm gonna take it slow and easy to get ready. I could wear this, or I could wear any of these, which I don't know. So I'll update you guys when I find something. Okay, I want these like cargos. We're gonna go listen to Lenny's room to see if she has my two shirts. Change of plans in the outfit. The black did not look good with the dark jeans. 
So we're wearing this cute top. It's from Garage. It's just like a square neck one. And then we're wearing my Zara jeans. I think we're gonna wear that. And now it is time to head downstairs. All right, I think it's time for breakfast. And then I need to change my backpack out for a day. And then breakfast. And then I'm done. I'm gonna make sure that my eyebrows will be slicked. I am in the little girls hangout. We are having some drama here because evidently these pants used to be Paisley's. Paisley got some new ones and now- They were mine to begin with. Oh wait, what? And they didn't fit me in the beginning. Oh, and then you gave them to her and then you yes, gave them back to you? Okay, well anyway, Paisley got new pants, but now who's wearing them? Sadie. Sadie's wearing Paisley's new pants. And she can't go get them because evidently Sadie put a hole in them. So we're just having drama, people. Drama city here. Drama, drama. Let's see how Presley's doing. I'm actually slaying, Mom. She's slaying. You're actually slaying? Slaying today. Wow. All right, well, gorgeous. How long till we're doing hair and uh, getting hey, dressed? Are we up to an hour? Uh, you know, I'm an hour, child. <laughs> I forgot I need to check on how Mr. B's doing. Ledger, I think, is discussing the ducks with the dad, which is great. I think Mr. B might have fallen back to sleep. Oh, yep, he's definitely still sleeping. Mr. B, it's time for breakfast. Come on, Mr. B, where are you? Oh, you're there! Ah! Say hi, Cozy. Cozy says hi. I don't wanna wake up. I know it's hard to wake up. It's so hard and you look so cozy. Let's go. It's almost time for breakfast. Yeah, Get yeah, ready. My Is that what you're wearing? The top you just have to find the jeans? Yeah. Just go find some cute and blue I jeans. Go my hair still because someone took my curling iron from my room too. Oh no. We'll go locate the curling iron. Go see if Navy borrowed it. Dad is going to have All right, boys. devotional with the boys. Ledger. What? Who is this? Jesus, Becca, how did you know that? Because it looks like this. Because it kind of looks like that? There's two things here. Do you know what's coming up? What's the next holiday coming up? Christmas. No, nope. we already Easter. had it. Yes, key five. and the clothes. Wow, look at these skills, people. Look at these skills. Yeah, breakfast with all the family and then Benji leaves with the intermediate kids. Bye, Navy. Bye, Navy. Bye, love you. Bye, guys. Love you. I need to check on Presley because she's probably not even done with her makeup yet. Speaking of that, me and Cass had a conversation and there's gonna be a few changes in, especially Presley's makeup and skincare routine. Anyway, so watch for that video. But I'm not really telling her because we're gonna discuss this with her later today. How's it going? <laughs> Is Robin tired? Yes. I like it. Robin, my mom's gonna do my hair because I'm right. tired. Sometimes the arms get tired when you're trying to make it perfectly smooth, huh? Yes. I know, right? So you did a good job so this far. This brush. is a a cinch. All right, one second. I like to get it with this one. Okay. And then I can go back over with the smoothing brush if I can. Makeup's actually slaying. Your makeup is slaying? In a way. Sometimes, oh, I mean a little bit. Like, kind of. Like, mascara yeah. sling. Mascara sling. My hair looks so big when I have already these buttons. Yeah, it's kind of fun. It looks like I have a lot of hair, but and I don't. Super easy. <laughs> it takes like five minutes. Okay, not even five minutes, five seconds. All right, go get dressed. I'm gonna wear this. All right, guys, this is my outfit. I literally love it. I feel like it's so cute. 
Don't mind my room, it's a really big mess, but it's okay, because my mom tells me it's a creative thing. <laughs> yes. Oh, someone helped you clean up your pile. Uh, I don't know. Did that help you? Something like that. All right, all right, all right. Are you ready to, oh, you're looking so good. Whoa. You're looking handsome. Whoa. Um, Mr. B, it's time to go get dressed. Okay. This is pretty cool, isn't it? Gonna do Ledger's hair handsome. He has a bowl. Cause I'm gonna get the duck eggs. Cause he's gonna get the duck eggs. Guys, slowly I think made blueberry muffins. Scrumshitty. Look at them. The teeth are now brushed. I'm gonna hurry and change and then I'll show you my outfit. Now we're gonna go to the microwave and heat these up for 15 seconds. Because. Okay. What the heck? Why is it a woman? Why does it look like that? Class dismissed. Hanson. Wow. Look at that cute uh, I still have my bowl. Yes, you still have your bowl for the eggs. Come here, Mr. B, let's do your hair. I like the hair. It like actually turned out really nice with the sleep. It kind of gave it a natural mohawk look. Are we gonna keep like kind of a little bit of the messy mohawk look? No. Or what are we gonna do? Do you want me to smooth it down and make it handsome? Like, kind of like a church? Push loose. Or like a skater boy? Skater. A skater boy. Or a baseballer. Oh, a baseballer. All right, wow, you look like a baseballer for sure. All right, let's go get your backpack, run! 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 This is not a drill, people, this is not a drill! This is not a drill! We are going to die! Are we going to do some ride? Bye, I love you, have a good day! I love you! Bye, Mr. B! Bye! What are you doing? Making my lunch. Oh, that's the only bag you could find? Yeah, there's no other. All right, no, just self. We need smaller Ziplocs. And now, chocolate oil. Sandwich bags. Oh, yeah, we are out. Okay, hurry, 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 run, 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 run. All right, fast. Quick, quick, quick. Ready, go. I'm taking the box to the What else, what else, what else? What else? I'm so happy. I love K-pop. All right, and fruit, fruit, fruit. Get a piece of fruit. Run, 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 run. Oh, some cucumbers. Uh, cucumbers, cucumbers. Ah, fast, fast, fast. Put the salt in there. Salt. Can you just a little bit of salt? Oh, we'll see. All right. Um, no Give me a lot of cucumbers. Get a small salt shaker. Yeah, for me. For me, school every day. All right, we need to sodium intake, people. <laughs> run. Bye, love you. Bye, love you too. Have a good day. Run. Bye. Have a good day. Love you. Bye. Run. All right, now that I got all the kids out the door, it's just me and Ledger, and so I am gonna get Ledger all cozied up, and we are gonna go for our walk. Ledger is busy playing with his favorite toys, and I am going to hurry and get my socks and shoes on, get my headphones, get all my walking gear, and then I'll get him ready. Do you wanna go out and get duck eggs? Okay, then put these socks on. Mom, you promise? I pinky promise. All right, get your shoes. <laughs> Got your yeah, socks on. I broke this part off and then somebody fixed it. Yeah, all right. Let's... That actually looks cool. It does look so cool. Hey, do you have a jacket though? Nope. How about a sweatshirt? Nope. How about something to keep you cozy and warm? Nope. Nope, all right. I'm good. You're good? Yeah. You sure about that? Yeah. Wait, mommy, I forget the duckings. Okay, I pinky promise after all, I need to go get the duckings. Yeah? I want to do right now. You're gonna help ducks and humans when you grow up? Yeah. Duck eggs are over here. Come see. You have to just get the ones that aren't cracked. Just get the ones that aren't cracked. Is there any that aren't cracked? Yeah, those ones are cracked. If they're cracked, you can't get them. Yeah. 
<laughs> Did you get them all? I don't have enough food. Mom, you have to carry this. I have to carry it? Yeah, because it's too much. Oh, I have to carry one. <gasps> I so get to carry a duck egg. These are all the duck eggs. Wow. Look at the duck eggs. Yeah. All right, let's go put them in a heater and see if they can grow babies. Mom, you found another duck egg. Oh, we found another one. It's clean. Yeah, it's clean. Okay, put it on. Oh, you have to hold this. oh, I have to hold this one too. Okay. So there's a hundred of duck eggs. Look at the hundreds of duck eggs that got too muddy in the mud. Yeah. All right. Why do they like to lay them in the mud, do you think? Yeah. Do you think it makes them think that they're going to be warm? Yeah. All right, let's go wash our they're hands not, with soap. They're not small. Let's wash our hands with soap, and then we're going to go on a walk. We are all ready for our walk. It's a crazy warm morning. We'll be back and then I can say goodbye to Lily because she goes to school kind of late. Bye bye, Birdie. Bye bye, Birdie. See you when we get back. It took me a fat second to find out what I was gonna wear. I'm just opening my water bottle. I'm wearing this, some cream pants with this shirt, with this jacket and these shoes. And then I'm just filling up my water and then I'm gonna go to school. Goodbye to Lily. First, I'm gonna say goodbye to you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Love you all. Bye.